And then the only other Y is Harbor Bushy, and it's not big enough. You can only turn a locomotive on that thing. Huh. So Rail America put this in. Yeah, they had no choice. Because right? Genesee yeah. wouldn't have put it in if they were going to abandon the line. No, no. So this was done before the sale. Brand new. So remember all that, those ties and everything we seen in the, in the, in the air last year? Yep. This is what they were for. We couldn't figure out where they were going. Uh, at least I couldn't anyway. Brand new, one kilometer stretch. Now these yellow sticks, I think, are where they have to stop if they're, if they're unhooking the train. So they won't foul a line. Oh, okay. Okay, so they bring the train in this way. And they want to turn around, bring, run the engines down and pick it up on the other side. They drop the train either on either one of them, whether it was the inbound or the outbound, right? Get over the hump and I guess we'll see how long it is. <laughs> well see from here it's downhill, right? So they're going downhill down into the to the main line. I can't, I don't think they would put a big Y and come back onto the here, although they have the room for it, but you think they would go down to the main line because I think you mentioned a while back that you heard it was attached to the main line, the Y. Yeah, I did. But I thought it was up further, right? Up closer to the, the junction to uh, at, at uh, Jefferson. Which is a long ways up to Jefferson from here. Yeah. It's good, um, I think it's, it's good <laughs> kilometers. That's new rail. It's all new rail, yeah. But it's Cisco rail. It's Cisco <laughs> rail. Where did they find that at? I think it came off of uh, the yards. There's not even rust on it, though. Now, that stuff back there said Cisco, but maybe this is... No, this is USA. 